Hello, my name is Harry Bermudez and I'm a professor here at the Polymer Science and Engineering Department. My research interests are the solution behavior of biological polymers, which includes proteins, nucleic acids, and polysaccharides. In my research group, and in a multidisciplinary field like polymer science, students use a variety of tools and methods uh, from chemistry, physics, math, and biology. Now let's go to the lab and look at some samples. So here we have two solids, which if mixed together under the right proportions, will give something that's a liquid at room temperature. These liquids are called deputectics. They're similar to the phenomenon that happens when you add salt to snow or ice in the winter. Uh, these deputectics have interesting solvation properties, and we're using them in one project to try and stabilize and improve the performance of industrially relevant enzymes. If that project is successful, it could lead to more efficient enzymes and more environmentally friendly processing. Now let me show you about another project over here. So we all know that bandages don't work well when our skin is wet. Let me demonstrate that. In fact, this is a problem with many adhesives, not just bandages. It turns out that ocean creatures called mussels have solved this problem by using special proteins. In one project in my group, we are using a form of supermolecular chemistry to create DNA polymers, which then bacteria like E. coli will convert into the corresponding protein. If this project is successful, it might lead to improved surgical coatings adhesives, or non-falling materials. We'd love to have you join us. Please feel free to contact me, and thanks for watching.